everyone, Zori Murray here. Welcome to my channel. Cezanne just released their lookbook for the Positano collection. Let's go over it. I'm gonna share my thoughts and my favorite pieces. And I wanna hear from you. Let me know in the comment section below. What do you think of this new collection? Are you gonna shop it? Which pieces are your favorite? If you enjoy watching today's video, give it a thumbs up. It really helps my channel. Consider subscribing, I would love to see you around more. And if you're active on social media, join me on Instagram and Facebook. Links to my pages are in the description box below. On there daily, I share discount codes, sale alerts, restock alerts, and new collection gossip. Now let's dive into the lookbook. The theme of this lookbook is Positano, and you can see in the video there is a lot of views from this really popular place in Italy. I have tried to visit Positano twice in the last couple of years, but it is so busy during the summer months. My plans fell through just because it's not enough to plan a trip to Positano two, three months in advance. You have to really plan like six months to a year if you want to book a good accommodation. But I do really hope to visit one day. I love this set here, this first image that is opening the lookbook, the green skirt and the shirt. I love the color. I think it's unexpected in a way. I love how it's paired and it looks like a dress. The skirt is so gorgeous with the buttons and the little details. I think this skirt for sure is gonna sell out, possibly the shirt as well. And this is the set that I'm gonna go for right when they release the new collection. I'm really excited for it. Moving down, there is a new pair of shoes, the Manon Espadrilles. From what I see, it looks like it's a chunky heel with a really large platform at the front, which usually means comfort because when you have a platform, it kind of like levels up your heel a little bit and it's easier to walk. I hope it comes in other colors because personally for the summer, I love going more colorful than black. And speaking of black, we see a new print on a black background, floral, and there are quite a few pieces in this print. You see the shorts, the tank top, this dress is really gorgeous. I mean, the styling, the model, she wears it so well. Personally, I find that strapless dresses don't really work for me. I feel like they look better on people with slightly larger chest and um, for that reason this is a no for me but I do love this picture like the model the shoes and the bag and her gold earrings and the minimal makeup the very natural look I think it's a beautiful styling moving down the dress over here the Sulita dress I love the length like if I am to go for a dress in this print I think this one would be my choice because it looks like a good length for a mini. I love that there are no sleeves, that you can unbutton it, really nice. And then side by side to the dress, we see the Gloria sandals, which are one of my favorite uh, sandals from Cezanne of all time. I have a few different colors in the heeled version and I absolutely love them. I also own the gold ones, like the flat version, and those are really nice as well quite a few pieces in this print and i always wonder how does Suzanne decide when to use a print in multiple pieces and other prints just get one or two i wish we could vote on that like they would be like oh here are the prints which ones do you want to see in multiple pieces that would be fun Moving down, we see that the paper dress is going to come in this floral and I think it's great. I love the paper dress. I just got my first one. I got the short version. I know the long one is really popular. It's just so comfortable. It's like wearing a t-shirt, but it is still feminine and really, really nice. Moving down, we have a new yellow print and here in the corner, I'm very excited about this bag. It has um, embroidered lemons. It has the essence of Southern Italy. It actually kind of makes me think of Sicily as well. You know, those tiles they have with the lemons, just 
really really in line with the theme of this collection i also really like this bag because it's big and it's good for summer like you can you can wear it to the beach you can wear it to town um right here this top it is called the louisa top i really like it i love the color it's really elegant i love the ruffle around the leg and the neck and the placement of the shoulder details is just chef's kiss and the placement of these details just makes such a big difference for example see how it looks on this top it's very chic it's very elegant but then if i go down they also have right here they have a dress it's the same detailing but it's placed in a very different way and in my opinion when it's placed like this on the neckline it looks very western and very cowboy so just little things like that completely change the feel of a piece and to me i prefer the blouse i love the sleeve and this more feminine elegant placement and if i had to pick i'll probably go with the blouse moving down this yellow print i'm really excited for it i wonder how saturated the yellow would be I'll be curious to see. This dress is really nice. I just recently tried this design in another color at the store. It was very comfortable. I really like the structure on the sleeve and you get few pieces. Personally, I would style this dress with like a blue sandal, like something blue, like the sweater I'm wearing. I think this shade of blue with this shade of yellow. It's a really nice, very summery combination. This short dress is really beautiful. The thick strap, the, the, look at the back. It's just so gorgeous, perfect for a really, really hot summer. I really like it. And I really, really like the high-waisted pants. I think the way they're patterned, the way the pattern falls on the pants looks really flattering. I love a high-waisted pant. I'm curious to see what will be the composition on these pants if they're kind of like a cotton with a little bit of linen I'll be interested to try them I think they're really nice and I already know that they'll be <laughs> crazy long but hey if it fits really nice on top definitely worth the extra effort of hemming the pants I see a lot of accessories like a lot of beautiful jewelry summertime especially if you have a hot summer I love leaning into accessories because you can't wear all that much, you know, like in spring and fall, you can layer, you can play with that. But in the summer, if you want to create a elegant outfit, an easy way to do that is to keep your outfit like really minimal and simple and then accessorize in an interesting way. And jewelry always plays a big role. We have this set, the yellow is really beautiful. It reminds me of sunflowers and also I think this top was part of the um, editions collection if I'm not wrong but like in the editions collection the top was paired with a matching uh, linen skirt here we have pants I love having more range here is another people dress I, I, I really I, I, I really like how the dress is paired with this embroidery basket it is a little bit of a smaller basket but to me summertime is the perfect opportunity <laughs> to wear baskets i love wearing baskets so much a good basket bag is a must-have for summer for sure we see another sandal really nice green blue color the justine basket looks like it's coming in embroidery flowers we have quite a few designs of the justine it is coming soon, which means it's not dropping this Sunday. But I love seeing a preview. I wish we could see the full collection, not just little snippets so we can plan better. Here is another paper dress in beautiful polka dots. Again, really fun, really timeless gladiator sandals. This dress, the Fabiola, I think if you like comfort, this should be on your shopping list. I saw the striped version. I also really liked it. There will be a khaki coming as well. 
it looks like the material it's kind of like a t-shirt material which means it will be stretchy and comfortable i love the square neckline and the buttons it is a really really great dress i'm definitely gonna try it i'm just not sure which color i don't think i'm gonna do black maybe the stripe one or the khaki i'm still debating then we have this dress over here it's called the Osiris dress and the graphic it's like really graphic right it reminds me of the Matisse prints that were very popular in interior design the last couple of years and what I really like is that here we can see that there is embroidery these graphic flowers are also on the back and for me that is really great I love a piece that is a 360 for comparison there is this other graphic piece down here, but there are no pictures of the back. So I'm not sure if these beautiful branches are on the back. And I really hope they are because, again, it will be such a missed opportunity if it's if it's like a, just a white back. I like this one. I like the very in-your-face graphic. It looks really nice. I do wonder if it's heavy. I can't quite tell. Like I'm looking at the material. I can't, it's not really telling me the thickness. So very curious about this piece, it's beautiful. This one, I mean the eyelet, the solita dress in eyelet, it reminds me of Santorini, it reminds me of Sicily. I love eyelet fabrics for summer. This blue is gorgeous, it's so vibrant. And again, the cut of this dress, it looks like it's mini, but it's not too short, so very excited for this one and we have another blue and white set which has a beautiful pattern over here I love the cinched waist I do think that this fabric will be too thick for the hot days of summer maybe like a more breezy summer night so I probably won't get this one but I do like the pattern I do think the pattern is really really beautiful then we have this dress i love it i love the blue the cobalt blue gloria sandals this pattern with the red and the blue is so nice and this from the look of it i think it's a 360 print so there will be a print on the back and i i really like it i love these two pictures next to each other i love the uh, brown tile with the blue it's a color combination that's right up my alley moving down i think this dress the caprice dress is going to be extra short <laughs> you can see even on the model it kind of looks short and i'm not sure why there is no belt i do think this dress needs a belt but what is very interesting in this photo is the shoes she's wearing and she's wearing a low gloria sandals in a light dusty blue color and <laughs> I want to press add to cart I have the gold low Gloria sandals I absolutely love them and I would be happy to add another pair of sandals that look like them or are exactly them so these I'm definitely getting them I wear size 7 US which is European 38 and usually the Gloria sandals are pretty consistent I have three pairs of the heeled version so I feel pretty confident we have another t-shirt style um, dress looks very comfortable very nice color it's kind of like a blue with like notes of purple we see a shirt and a skirt it's really beautiful I love this combo I love this shirt I think it will look really great with a jean skirt or like a pair of denim shorts when i first saw uh, this image i thought it was a jumpsuit but now i'm seeing that it is a swimsuit and a pair of high-waisted pants personally i think that combo is a little bit too much i think maybe because the colors are so saturated and between the two pieces i definitely like the swimsuit it looks beautiful it reminds me of porcelain tile then we have a few pieces in white white 
eyelet fabric and again I think that's one of the most perfect fabrics for summer I love the midi one I like the mini one you can go wrong pairing any eyelet piece with a basket so all of these are so great so easy this is the green dress this is the green fabiola dress that I was telling you about so either this one or the brown and white stripes I am torn between the two I want to try one of the two and I think the stripe one is currently sold out so maybe I'll try with uh, trying this green one I really don't want to be hunting any restocks so on Sunday I'm gonna try to grab everything that I want I have spent my last few weeks trying to get restocks and that meant being awake past midnight multiple nights and I managed to get what I want but you know how it is I don't like hunting for restocks this fabric I adore and I'm actually a little disappointed that we're only shown two pieces in this beautiful colorful checkered fabric I want a dress in this I'll get it so fast I just really like the colors but these two pieces you can see over here the tank top is just a little bit too cropped for me I think and then the shorts they have this pleating I, I I think the tie front is a little bit thick for my taste but again this fabric chef's kiss we know that they like to surprise us so there are more pieces that are not in the lookbook that I can promise you moving down we have this gorgeous crochet dress and it's really unique like I see a lot of crochet pieces this summer most of them are a solid color having this um, pink and red and green and blue embroidery it really makes this piece stand out so it's very nice I saw that there will be some tops in this same fabric as well we're going to see a return of the Kelia blouse and I think from all the Kelia blouses that I've seen I like this one the most this shade of blue is perfection and the little flowers I think this one will be a piece that will sell out really really quickly to me the Kellia has one issue and that is my size which is 34 European US 2 when I lean forward there's like a big gap that is kind of forming and I, there is no option for me to go down in size so that's one thing that I don't really love about the Kellia but if it fits you please get it because look how gorgeous with this light yellow pants I'm obsessed and then we are gonna have a Isabella bag with a blue color which looks gorgeous I have the natural color Isabelle bag and I love it I think it's too specific for me to get it in another color but if you don't have an Isabelle bag and you've been contemplating one I do think this blue is stunning and on this model with this white dress ugh, I love it I love this outfit and that concludes the lookbook I have to say that this lookbook feels rather small compared to a few of the previous ones which makes me think they have a lot of surprises up their sleeve we can expect another teaser maybe around mid-may I think that's not confirmed but I think that there will be like more to this definitely because it is rather small oh and by the way if you're shopping for your significant other they just released the new October editions collection the summer one and I got Henry a shirt and a t-shirt and they're both like really nice colors they're very beautiful they have that same vibe as all the new Cezanne pieces so if you're preparing your vacation wardrobe definitely stop by October editions as well all right, everyone, this is it for today. Thank you so much for watching. Let me know in the comment section below what do you think of the new Cezanne Positano collection? Are you gonna shop? Which pieces are your targets? I wanna know. Don't forget to join me on social media. Links to my Instagram and Facebook pages are in the description box below. On there daily, I share discount codes, sale alerts, restock alerts, and new collection gossip. If you enjoy watching today's video, give it a thumbs up. It really helps my channel. Consider subscribing. 
I'd love to see you around more. Have a wonderful week and see you next time.